Trooper Island was started in uh, 1965 by some troopers uh, on an island down on Dale Hollow Lake. Uh, I think the closest town to it is probably Albany. Uh, we take from each post, we take about 32 kids a year down. Uh, somewhere an average of 700, 800 kids a year statewide. We take kids that are uh, 10 to 12 years old, uh, and we like to have kids that may not have a chance to go someplace during the summer. Uh, if you want to say a little more underprivileged than some of the other ones that don't have a chance to, to go out and do things like uh, some other kids would. Uh, the first day they go in, they register for whatever they want to take, uh, and uh, they are actually have some, a little bit of training in canoeing, archery, air rifles, swimming. If they can't swim and they want to learn, they can while they're there. Uh, we have uh, different things going on. There's actually a, little, a small church service on Wednesday afternoon. Uh, we also have a like a question and answer session with the troopers. We we don't wear uniforms during the whole time we're there. We're dressed as, as the kids would be. Uh, but we will put our uniforms on on Wednesday afternoon or Wednesday night and, and talk to them as troopers to let them know that we are uh, a civilian life just like they would have and we're just troopers when we're in uniform and you know we're there for them anytime. We will go with, with the Hazard Post also. We will leave Monday morning uh, the 8th of July and return Friday afternoon the 12th. I'd like to have it as soon as possible to get the numbers and stuff because we've got a lot of work to do on each application. I, I can take them up till you know just a few days before, but I'd like to have them as early as possible.